Want to know the secret to negotiating with developers in a hot market? Stick around. I'm Sepp Niacon, founder of Blackbook Properties and kind of blackbook.com, and we're the only guide you need to get to know Miami real estate and lifestyle like an insider. But before we get started, be sure to hit the subscribe button below to get our latest videos on everything Miami every week. We're in an incredibly strong market right now with a lot of buyer demand. And in strong markets like these, when inventory of existing properties is very low, developers launch new projects to meet the demand. You can buy into these projects early in the development phase or the pre-construction phase. One question we get asked a lot from our clients looking to buy into a new pre-construction project is can you negotiate with developers when their projects are selling like hotcakes? And the answer is yes, you can. Of course, a key aspect of this is having a strong realtor experience in negotiating and closing deals in pre-construction projects. If you've got that, here's where you can focus your negotiations. The first point you can negotiate in pre-construction is, believe it or not, the price. We've gotten buyers deals on pre-construction properties below the asking price or with extra perks thrown in. And the only way you can know is if you ask. Sometimes they'll give a significant discount, let's say 50 grand, sometimes it's 15,000, but there's always a possibility to decrease the price and it never hurts to try. Another important term you can negotiate that will affect the overall cost of purchasing is the developer fee. Developers charge developer fees at closing, it's built into the contract, and they're typically structured as a small percentage of the asking price, let's say 1.7%. These can be negotiated and whittled down to a smaller fee, usually at the contract phase, not at the reservation phase, for technical reasons. The reason there's an opportunity here for a discount is that the developer's actual closing costs is less than the percentage fee they charge. Developers typically have some flexibility on the deposit amounts and payment timelines depending on a variety of factors that are too boring to get into in this video. But rest assured that if you need a bit more time to get the second or third deposit in, or maybe you want to put a total of 40% instead of 50% or maybe even less than 40% over the course of the project, sometimes that can be worked out. And it could be a great advantage to you depending on your individual situation. More terms you can negotiate that many agents and buyers don't always think about are parking and perks. Negotiating an extra parking space or storage space is definitely a valuable win considering these can cost tens of thousands of dollars later on. Other perks like beach or lifestyle club memberships or interior finish packages, upgrades, etc. can also be negotiated into your purchase. If there's a perk or an upgrade package that is meaningful to you, make sure you ask about it up front. As in any negotiation, you have to expect that while you're negotiating, another buyer may swoop in and take the unit at full asking price right out from under you. So if you have a particular unit you are really in love with, sometimes it might make sense to just pay the asking price and terms and lock it in. But if you have the stomach for uncertainty or flexible with what you're willing to buy, if you lose your first option, then definitely go for the negotiation. If you're interested in buying pre-construction or need someone to negotiate for you to get the property you're in love with, reach out to us directly and leave a comment below. And make sure to check out our other pre-construction videos, including some of the latest properties on the market. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.